And welcome to the Incredible Hoax Remote Edition. I am Chris. I am Mark. And we have just left the theater from seeing uh, Star Wars episode... I gotta take a breath. Star Wars Episode Nine: The Rise of Skywalker. Holy God, that took forever to say. This is a media reaction. Um, spoilers or no spoilers? Uh, two minutes of non-spoiler. Right? Two minutes of non-spoiler. Immediate reaction and go. Ooh. Um, a, a it's a very reaction. busy. <laughs> it's a very busy movie uh, to start with. That for me was more of a negative thing to say. Uh, kind of underwhelmed. Uh, let's see. I didn't think the movie had a whole lot of energy. Partly because it has so many check marks it's trying to do, trying to finish so much stuff. Yeah. You have characters move here, they move there, they move here. But it's just kind of more of just the mechanics of moving here and there and not enough engaging story for me. So I was, I was kind of disappointed in this movie. I give it two and a half out of four stars. And, um, you know, it, I mean, I, I, once again, Oscar Isaac is the highlight. I'm just, I, what he does with Poe Dameron, I just wish, yeah. you know, we'd had more Poe in that trilogy. Yeah. Um, what else can I say? I mean, it's just it's kind of it's kind of a letdown uh, in a way. But one plus I will say is rather than try to, in my opinion, with the whole last last Jedi fiasco, it just decided to move forward and not really a, a address a lot of the stuff. I that's that, what I thought. Wow, we saw two completely different movies. Liter like almost point for point, we well, saw two different movies. Well, specifically with Luke is. Is why I say that. Well, okay. And I wasn't going to get my... I knew I was not going to get my wish on the Luke thing. Well, they were going to bring him back to life. I, I know, but they... they, they was, I, well, I wanted more. Shit, I think I just did a spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> I still... We got to read it back in. Because that mm -hmm. might have been a spoiler right there. Oops on that one. So, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I would have liked. I would have liked to have seen, for my money, a little more uh, tribute and honor be paid to that character. He deserved it. Okay, so we saw two different movies. I thought the energy was fine. I thought the uh, uh, it was a busy. Now I will give you the busy thing. That's a that, that's a fact. It's a very busy movie, but I didn't see it as, as the detriment you did. It definitely does bounce back and forth a lot between different locations, and they gotta go here. They gotta, it's almost like you ever like run errands and you have to go to like a whole bunch oh, of yeah. places in one day. It's almost like the movie had to do that. Like I gotta go to the post office. I gotta go to the bank. I gotta go by work yeah. and pick up something. I gotta go to, to Walmart. And go to the, the drugstore. That was one big honeydew list. There's a hell of a lot of sh shit to yeah. cover. That's a fact. Now that is a fact. That's undeniable. No matter you like the movie or didn't like the movie, it is got a lot of shit going on. Right. Um. As far as I liked it a lot. I liked it a lot, lot, lot. The movie to me uh, was a giant F you to Ryan Johnson and The Last Jedi. I thought it did a lot of the stuff that he had done. And it did it as well as they could. I think, my honestly, with the hole he put them in as filmmakers, yeah. I thought they did the best they could. And a I, I think a lot of the faults of the movie are carryover from it suffered from The Last Jedi. And they had to do the best they could with it without getting into a whole bunch of spoilers and stuff. Right. Uh, all the performances were good. Uh, I didn't hate any character like I did in Last Jedi where I was hating characters and things like that. Mm -hmm. um, spoilers. Now, spoilers in... Because I don't know how else to say without getting into spoilers. Spoilers in yeah, five, but... four, three, two, one. Spoilers. I'll go first on the spoiler part. Okay. Um, so Ray's lineage is now known. It's a known thing. Yes. And I don't know if I want to cover that in the spoilers. But we'll just say that it's a known thing. I don't want to say exactly what it is because I don't want to be yeah, too the, much. There's here. finality to that question. Right. Uh, that, that's given. If here. that's what you want, and, you're, you're, you're going to get finality. That was a little shaky. I'll admit that was a little shaky. But what they did with it ultimately served its purpose um i thought that um uh the way they brought back uh because it's, it's a known thing this is not spoiler yeah. everybody knows the emperor comes back in this one that was in trailers and things right right way they handled that uh made sense it fit the movie um 
uh, what else? The the Kylo story arc to me was completely satisfying. Uh, race, other than the lineage thing, I was satisfied with her story arc. I was satisfied with all the story arcs, and there are certain mistakes that the Last Jedi made. Even the little ones they fixed. Rose, Rose was a horrible character. I have to admit they fixed Rose. Um, things like that. They, they did a good job with fixing. So the trailers didn't do this movie justice, I felt. Like, I, th I was cringing the trailers with the C-3PO Yeah, we scenes. were critical of the, how underwhelming the trailers were. Now that I've seen the For movie, sure. the trailers sucked. The trailer, oh, yeah. the, the whole yeah. representation of the C-3PO stuff in the trailers was the, not a correct representation of the movie. That all stuff all at work. Right. The, there's a scene where a major character dies, and if you have any common sense, you'll know who it is. I mean, I have to really spell to you who dies. Uh, and you have a reaction from, from Chewie that absolutely just killed me. I was literally crying, sobbing. Sure. In that moment. Yeah, it's the most uh, effective scene in the movie. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, ultimately, I loved it. I don't think it's a perfect movie, but uh, I, I will watch it again. I, I actually look forward to watching it again. I really do. Go for it now. Your spoiler, <laughs> your spoiler, <laughs> but don't go too far. No, I mean, don't no, tell no, them, don't go so. off the rails with no, it. No, no, no. Uh, well, uh, well, let's just start with the whole uh, Ray thing. Um, in retrospect, you can see uh, how they that character and her parents, the whole that question. That was they made such a big deal of it and whatnot, and here they they they're kind of forced to like, oh, well, we gotta go, we gotta go big with that answer now because we've made it such a big deal and fans didn't like Last Jedi, so I I could see where, what to your point, where Last Jedi kind of gave them kind of a bad, they were dealt a kind of a, a bad hand, a and them. instead of letting the character really advance, they. They had to just make. It's like okay, well, there, there's our bed. It's been made for us. We got to run with that. So that's kind of disappointing in that regard. I would have loved to seen Ray be able to be more than just that. Okay. But um, what else? Um, Adam Driver. I like him as an actor, and the choices they make with his character. Or uh, honestly, I didn't want him to go that way. Uh, the choices they made. I'll just leave it at that. Okay. Because I just think that um, it kind of just un under it undermines, I think, the, the other two films, in my opinion. Um, now, cause talk about your Luke stuff, because I know you want to get off your chest. Oh, oh, get your Luke stuff my, off your chest. I've been saying for months, my, my criteria for this movie was fix Luke, don't suck. So, those two parts. Okay, did they fix Luke? No, they did not. And number two... Don't suck. Well, underwhelmed. It didn't suck. It's not Last Jedi. No. It does not. It's not you a have to like it better than Last Jedi. Oh yeah, of course. Okay. Yeah, it, yeah, of course. Uh, it's it's such a. It is definitely an improvement on Last Jedi. I mean, you, uh, that movie was so bad you had nowhere to go but up. For, uh -huh. Of course. Um, it's hard. It's kind of really hard to like talk about this movie without wanting to get really into the weeds and get. We'll do all, another review and all wonky. We'll do another about review it. where we but do I, a weeds re review. But I will say this: um, I remember Clone Wars when they brought back Darth Maul. Uh -huh. They decided to just say, "Well, he's back," and just kind of left you just kind of just just figure it out. They had like robot they, legs or they, whatever. They, yeah, they didn't know, they didn't over explain it. Okay. So there's some things in this movie where they're probably wise not to over-explain stuff. Yeah. So why is that character? You know, yeah, just just go with it. And that's probably, in its defense, there was a few moments where I was like, yeah, and if, you, if this was like episode one, you'd want to give more background. Uh, but here it's like, yeah, just we got to get the movie going. Right, right, here. right, right. But when you do that, you do kind of under undercut the kind of the emotional... Um, Climaxes that should have been there. Let me ask this, and we'll end on this. Note. What did you want them to do with Luke? Don't talk about what they did. What did you want them to do? Like you're in charge. What do you? What, I, do you, what, I, what did you want them to do? With Luke? I wanted Luke, even if it was a very small way, to participate in the battle. Wow. Well, okay. Uh, and, I, and I knew that they were like they're not going to do that. Be like, but, that'd be like a ghost guy. But that, but 
but um, to me, what they did with, well, I don't, I don't want to say this, it's a spoiler. Well, uh, how do I want to say this? Well, let's just say a certain character in the film, I thought that what they did with that character, they could have done something similar with Luke. And I would have been like, oh, okay, okay, that's, you, I knew you couldn't do much, but at least you did that. And uh, um, so. I, I don't know what he's talking about. Well, Leia. Oh, yeah, okay. Reaching okay. out to. to oh, okay, 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 uh, okay, okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Well, but see, I think the thing is, she was is alive. And he is not. So there are certain things that the the living can do, and the certain things that the, the the living the dead can't. So that was something she could do, and well, you that's know, not something I, I think he they've could. Heard, I think they've established that the, the, the Jedi ghost can appear and interfere at times. Yeah, I mean, I mean, Yoda appearing to say, "Look, look," you know, in Last Jedi, yeah. I mean, you know. Hits him on the head, even. Yeah. Physically hits him on the head with that right. cane, for heaven's sakes. So, hey, man, you've been letting fear get, you know, the better of you. you got to get back in the game. Right. And uh, so I think they could have done it. I didn't expect him to be like, you know, 30 minutes of Luke battling uh, the sword. I didn't expect that. I, I think. But I think there could have been something done a little more to, like, to, to say, hey, guys, last year I really did this major character wrong. And yeah. we're trying to acknowledge, as best we could, that he was uh, a major player. And it would have been nice uh, if he could. He would have been the one, like really, at one one of the low points. If his doing something was the thing that thrust them over the finish line, that would have been. Uh, that would have been. Did you see this movie? Well, it, did you did, did you have like a brain lapse and not watch? No, this movie? I, I just it wasn't enough for me. I'm, I, I know what the scene you were talking about, but it's not enough. It wasn't enough for me. It's okay. Well, I, I, yeah, I go back to. Anyway. I understand, and and your 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 desires on that are your desires, and I don't belittle them. Right. I think the less Jedi, we still are un un undoing. There's that movie is worse than we thought it was. Yeah, the da the, the damage, damage the damage it yeah. did was deeper than we thought. Mm. And again, I go back to all of the criticisms of this movie are carryovers from Last Jedi that they inherited. And right, I don't. I think the Last Jedi is one of those movies that, like, twenty years from now, you could t do a whole fucking thesis. Or film school class on how bad it is. Sorry, I mean, I cussed the from a kid, but well, <laughs> it's not the first time. Um, yeah, I think it's so yeah. bad, it's legendary. Like, right. it's you could do an entire, like, semester of a film school just on how bad The Last Jedi is. Well, and, and, and we've we've done other shows talking about Star Wars, and so my my uh, affection for the character Luke Skywalker, Luke Skywalker is well stated, and yeah. so that was always going to be a, a, a thing where it's like, Last year, I totally did not do justice to this character. You're gonna have to do something, and and and, and I and I kept saying, I don't know what you're gonna do, but I thought they achieved it. I, I it's and, and I they, don't even know that you can do it, but give it your best try. I thought they did, and I mean for what they did, it was respectable, but it wasn't enough for me. Well, um, his intro, right there, did it. Right there, just the intro alone did it to him. Well, I... I don't want to ruin it. Not, well, I, Just as it, intro it, did. It's one of those things. I'm, I'm, I'm relieved that you, you did like it. I, I just... It, it wasn't enough for me. Okay, let me let me just say so. this. I, f I feel that. I feel that if you were to sleep on it, and you're probably going to watch it again because it's Star Wars, you'll probably end up watching it again. Unless you just hated it more than I thought you did. <laughs> <laughs> I think once you watch it again, I think you're... It, it, once you've slept on it and you watch it again, I think your opinion will change. Because I think they did more better service to him than, than maybe you're giving him credit for right now. But it's just my opinion. You're, you're, that river runs deep for you. Deeper than it does me. Well, and, yeah. I, and I totally yeah. acknowledge that. Yeah. That, that's a, that was more of a hurt for you than it was for me. Right. And, and that's one of those things. That I, it's like, hey, people hear two and a half stars. Like, well, you know, a lot of people who are not that invested in the Luke character, maybe. Yeah. There, this movie ends up being four stars, and that's fine. But for me, uh, again, fix Luke, don't suck. That was my criteria. 
Well, I thought I achieved both those things. So it, 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 did, it did it for me. All right. Well, we'll probably do a, a full show where we go more specific in this guy's. One, one final thing I will yeah. say is I tell you who, who really got a lot of moments in this movie. What is that? Millennium Falcon. <laughs> Oh God! It's like one of the stars of the it's fucking movie. Like, it was the, the star of this movie. Yeah, it was. It was. Yeah. <laughs> so if you want the Falcon, you get Falcon. Yeah. yeah, the Falcon is the yeah to the max. Falcon to the max. Falcon to the max. <laughs> well, we'll do another show where it'll probably take more like 30, 45 minutes or whatever to get into it, and yeah, we'll yeah. do a full show, and then we'll yeah, uh, get, we'll get want more. And we won't worry. What? <laughs> I want to say something. Say it. Go for it. Oh, here he goes. He got a Sith Trooper collector cup. And and uh, yeah, he got a picture with a stormtrooper. He got a, he got a picture of the stormtrooper. Yeah, my dad got one. Yeah, yeah. I got I got a, 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 a Knight of Ren collector cup. Look at that. Yeah. If we come back and watch it again, we'll get the other ones. The other ones. And if you, oh, and if you're a three PO fan. Yeah, it's it, there's a whole lot of three PO love in this movie. Yeah, there's, yeah, that's, that's there's three that PO cup. Yeah, there's, there's a three PO cup. cup. All right, we'll do another show where we get deeper, deeper into the stuff. Go ahead, what are you gonna say? There's a color room one. Too. Yeah, those four. And uh, Bye -bye. look for that. We'll do it soon. We'll do it in the next week or so. Yeah, Still soon. Here. Very All right, soon. We'll do it very soon. And uh, we'll and then that one we'll get into the spoilers. Like we'll, we'll not stop ourselves. Yes. At all. Yes. It'll be yeah. No holds barred. Right. Well, you're gonna see it no matter what we. Well, no matter what we think we're doing, you're gonna go see it anyway. Right. So just enjoy, have fun, and uh, eat lots of popcorn and talk to you later. Bye bye. Thank you.